Guys, thanks for watching Everyday Ready. Today we are learning about binary codes and how spies or just, you know, security-minded individuals might hide uh, secret codes within that bunch of ones and zeros that make up binary coding, okay? Uh, there's actually eight placements <laughs> total. Um, the first three placements in binary code actually uh, correspond to capitalization, which we're not going to use today because if we're just looking at simple words uh, transferred into a coding language, um, we don't need to worry about whether they're they're uh, they're capitalized or not. So we're going to deal with the other five. I'm going to try to make this as simple as possible. I'm not giving you a full tutorial on this. This is really so that you can. Uh, search any of the July videos for the secret code and then decipher it using binary, which I'm going to teach you right now. And then you can email me once you've figured out the code and get yourself uh, entered for a chance to win a hundred bucks this month. Uh, it goes on every single month if you're new to the channel. You definitely want to beat Nick. Nick is the guy who has won just about every single month since I started this. Your goal is to beat Nick. So uh, I'm going to teach you about number codes. You can find the secret code in any of the videos this month. Email me with the code. You could win. So here we go. Uh, you've seen binary codes. There's zeros and there's ones, right? And basically what the ones and the zeros correspond to, they have two values. If it's a one, it means it's on. If it's a zero, it means it's off. So one equals on, zero equals off, okay? And then uh, you also read binary code, these five digits, you read that from right to left, okay? So you kind of go backwards. Now, um, each of the code placements has a value that actually doubles as you go up. So what that looks like is you've got one here and then it doubles to two and then it doubles to four doubles to eight doubles to 16. that's each of your five placements right each of your five placements so what i kind of like to do sometimes is just draw a little bit of a diagram this helps me figure things out let's say our secret message was the name ron and we were going to hide that within binary code now we have to know what letter of the alphabet the R is. That happens to be 18. And in case any of you think that I'm super smart and just know where the placements are, I'm not. Just out of camera, right over there is my computer. And I've got a little cheat sheet pulled up. Uh, so the O is 15 and the N is 14. Now what we need to do is using these numbers, we add up the placements. So if, it's, so if we've got R, so if we've got R, O, and N, and we wanted to, to write binary code for the letter R, we know we're gonna have 16. So we're turning 16 on, and we're turning two on. 16 plus two equals 18, and the rest of these are off, off, off. So the binary code for R looks like that. All right, and then 15, we know we're gonna need an eight, eight four is 12 and 12 plus 2 is 14 plus 1 is 15 so the binary code for O looks like that and N this one's gonna be off this is gonna be on 8 and 4 is 12 that's gonna be on 12 and 2 is 14 that's gonna be on that's gonna be off so our binary code for the word Ron looks like that. You, you wanna give yourself some cheat sheets, right? You can just Google this uh, and pull up a cheat sheet on your computer for the, new, the number substitution cipher, right? A equals one, B equals two, C equals three, and so on. Um, and then just remember that, you know, to write yourself out some sort of a, a graph or a diagram like this, write your word out, whatever you're trying to figure out, just give yourself some space and put it on paper like this. It makes it a lot easier. Um, leave me some questions if you don't fully understand that. Uh, but uh, I'm going to encode something that looks like this, you know, a bunch of encoding. 
into one of the videos. You'll, you'll have to look at it. Sometimes it's hard to see on cell phones, so if you can look at my videos on your laptop or your, your desktop computer, that could help. But you'll see something like that in one of the July videos um, this, uh, this month and figure out what the code word is or the phrase and then also figure out what my email is. It's on the YouTube channel and email me with your answer for a chance to win 100 bucks. Guys, thanks for watching today. Hopefully this little binary code description is enough for you to play along and, and maybe win that money. So thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button, at least the thumbs up for me. That'd be awesome. We'll see you in the next video. Everyday ready for the adventures you choose and the emergencies you don't.